Hey YouTube, Mark Kaufman here, and today I'm talking about the Frost, and I can't really pronounce this properly. I think it's OC River Barlow. Now this Barlow is $15, and for me, I know that's a pretty cheap knife. Um, not a lot of guys really like Frost knives, but for me, I loved the bolster. This bolster here is really nice, really large, and comparing it to other Rough Rider knives or old timer knives or a few other knives that have a Barlow pattern in their uh, lineup. This bolster really was one of the biggest ones I could see. And I'm really happy with this knife. Has a half stop, pretty good springs on this knife also. And pretty good lineup on the springs and the liners. When it comes to the handle though, there's a little bit of gapping, I think. You can see through it there. No, you can't see through it, but you can see that the gapping is there. Now that's not really a problem. This is gonna be a user for me. And for me, what I was really happy with was the amount of snap the blades have. Now granted, this is probably not the best sharpening job in the world, and I've already had to strop it, and right now it's pretty dull. And I'm going to have to sharpen it, but other than that, these are pretty good knives for the money. Now, what I was really impressed with is the amount of tension they put in the small pen blade. Uh, it's really, really strong. You can see that I kind of struggled to get it open, but for me, I find this to be a very good little blade. It's not as sharp as I would have wanted it because, well, they really didn't sharpen it. Can you see that silver line right there? on the blade there that is actually the unsharpened portion so this blade actually doesn't cut anything um, I've stropped it a little bit and it does a really rough cut but I'm going to be sharpening it up probably in a later video or off camera uh, pretty soon so I can use it but other than that I have found it to be a very good poker and a good uh, pencil sharpener they did get it sharp down here, which is where I've actually been using it, but when it comes to the middle here, no, not sharp at all. So for $15, you're not getting a completely sharp knife, but you're getting a pretty handsome knife and one with really good springs, or at least in my case, it has great springs. The bone on here is a beautiful, beautiful blue. It's almost a ocean blue uh, bone here and then you get pretty decent bolsters and then the shield isn't too bad either. So I think overall this is a very good knife and if you were wanting to pick one up, they have it in black bone, buffalo horn, and I think a green jig bone and then a blue jig bone. I have not seen red, but if they had red, I'd probably pick one of those up also. So thought you guys would enjoy seeing this one. Till the next one, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.